It's my guy knows a guy. Thanks for watching my NBA betting report on my Frenzy Sports YouTube channel. On today's video, I'm gonna quickly discuss my pick of the day. If you've been following me on Twitter, at my guy knows a guy, you'll know that I've caught a bit of a hot streak recently as I've improved my NBA picking record to 101, 69, and one against the spread on the season. At this point in the season, we have a large sample size of data to make our picks. The game I wanna focus on today is the matchup between the Los Angeles Clippers and the Indiana Pacers. Some injury news in this game, Kawhi Leonard is out for the Clippers. He's suffering from foot pain and Miles Turner for the Indiana Pacers is going to miss his seventh consecutive game. But on this pick, I'm gonna keep it short and sweet. The Indiana Pacers are garbage at home this season against the spread. It doesn't matter who they're playing, they're almost an auto-fade team. The Clippers are on a pretty decent win streak, although they failed to cover the spread against the Detroit Pistons at home on Sunday. I feel like the Clippers overlooked the Pistons a bit. The Pistons looked really hungry that night. The body language of the Clippers wasn't really positive, especially defensively, as they allowed the Pistons to score over 120 points. Let's check out some of the against the spread metrics in this Clippers-Pacers matchup. As you can see, the Indiana Pacers are 7-17 and at home against the spread this season. Absolutely terrible. They're even worse coming off a win. They just defeated the Memphis Grizzlies on the road. It's pretty strange, though, because on the road, the Pacers are pretty decent. There might be something going on in that stadium. I'm not sure what's really the cause of this. The Pacers also haven't covered two point spreads in a row since March 21st. And I just think stylistically, without Miles Turner, it's going to be really, really difficult for the Pacers to stop anyone tonight. I also think on the flip side, it'll be difficult for the Pacers to score themselves. So we could be seeing a game where the Clippers cover the spread easily on the road. However, in this game, I like the Clippers to cover the three points on the road in Indiana. I feel like the total of this game is extremely inflated due to the fact that the Pacers have scored a lot of points and allowed a lot of points in the absence of Miles Turner. The strength of schedule for the six games that Miles Turner has missed due to injury doesn't stack up against the strength of this Clipper team that they're going to face tonight. 232 is just too high for any Indiana Pacers game. I think the physical nature of the Clippers will keep this game under. They'll impose their will. Give me the Clippers to cover and the under 232 total in this game. I've been pretty hot recently, and I'm going to continue to go with what works. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe to the Frenzy Sports YouTube channel, follow me on Twitter at MyGuyKnowsAGuy, and share this video with a friend. I'll be doing this a lot more often.